my awesome Scorpios. I missed you guys. Scorpio, I hope you're doing wonderful wherever you are. Scorpio, you want a soulmate reading to check up on the latest energies between you and your soulmate. First, we're going to ask what's coming up for you, Scorpio. What you'll be dealing with facing in your life and how you're currently doing on your soulmate journey. Second uh, part of this video, we're going to ask about your soulmate. Whoever it is that you're thinking of concentrating on while watching this video, whether you're currently in contact with them or not. First, we're going to ask how this person is doing at this time and how they are currently relating to you emotionally. What's on their mind? What are they thinking, feeling at this time? Especially, oh, this one wants to show up very strongly as extra message especially emotionally towards you universe please show us what's coming up for scorpio in the life and how is scorpio currently doing on their soulmate journey what's coming up for scorpio in the life and how is scorpio currently doing on their soulmate journey two extras very interesting oh you you are accomplishing something major at your job or business, you're going to be rewarded for your diligent work, whether you have your own business or uh, work for somebody else, whoever it is that you're working with or for. It shows that you have some jealousy towards you, um, but you can't let that distract you. So you know that when people are jealous, that means you're doing something right. Continue doing what you've been doing. Keep being passionate and proactive. You have talent, whatever it is that uh, you working on currently you have talent you see this is beautiful Plus, oh yeah you're gonna have to defend yourself at your job or business so you have jealousy towards you at your job and you're gonna have to stand up for yourself speak up for yourself if you haven't already you will do so you're gonna break that silence people can't fool you people can't pull wool over your eyes because you have wisdom you see very clearly who authentic people are in your life and who fake people are. Yeah, you see it very clearly. This is you standing up for yourself, defending your good name. You see? Wow. Let's see what's going on here. Your soulmate is missing you. They want to communicate with you. They feel empty without you, alone, sad. So you're not in a relationship right now with this person. They're missing you a lot. Yeah. They're waiting for this communication to happen. This person wants to communicate with you. Let's see. You must please show us. You let them go, though. Yeah, you let them go. You told them what time it is. Yeah, you, you tell them goodbye. Yeah, you did because you were frustrated. This person, for some reason, didn't meet you halfway, didn't put work into this relationship, didn't offer a solid commitment like you were hoping. Universe, please show us whether they couldn't because something is going on in their life or were scared to. They didn't meet you halfway. Universe, please show us what's coming up for Scorpio in their life and how is Scorpio currently doing on their soulmate journey? Why is this showing up face down? Oh... Face down and reversed. Yeah. You deeply regret at times meeting this person. So they inflicted heartbreak on you. They didn't mean to honestly inflict it. But the point is you went through heartbreak and you want to let them go completely. You don't want to feel this love anymore. You feel like they haven't earned your love. Yeah. That's how you feel. This is a serious connection, past life history showing up between you two. Yeah, you see very clearly what's going on at your job business. So whatever it is that you're trying to succeed at your job or business, it's, it's divinely ordered. You're going to succeed. Yeah, just keep following your passions. Wow, Scorpio, this is heavy. Yeah, you see, you are going to be successful. This is money coming in, profit coming in due to your diligent, detailed work. You are a pro at what you do. Yeah. Yeah, you see, look at this. You're going to have to defend yourself at your job yeah, or business. So there are some, there's one person in particular uh, that is very jealous of you. Here they're showing up with this eye and claws and showing up here as a fox so there's someone that is 
very jealous of you and doesn't want to see you succeed, but they can't stop you from succeeding. They're just creating karma for themselves when they wish that on other people. So whatever it is you're doing, continue doing it. Continue being proactive, passionate, because you are going to succeed, you see? Hmm. Yeah, you walked away from your soulmate. You did. You, you made a conscious decision that it was best for you to walk away. You felt very empty, alone in this relationship. You felt unloved, unappreciated, taken for granted. Yeah, you see? Here you are showing up as Queen of Swords with your sword raised up. And here's your work showing up again. So you're going to stand up for yourself successfully. Yeah, you're going to defend your good name. People will try to blame you for things that you didn't do. People will be gossiping. You will uh, defend yourself. You will defend your good name. Yeah. Mm. My gosh, why do people do this? They just love creating drama for others. Let's see. Universe, please show us what's coming up for Scorpio in their life. And how is Scorpio currently doing on their soulmate journey? temperance uh, this person of yours wants to re-enter your life they slow yeah they're missing you a lot this is them reminiscing of you thinking of you missing you a lot very emotionally attached to you past life connection with this person they love you a lot yeah they do this person loves you a lot a lot of you are dealing with pisces sagittarius Silence showing up here. No communication. You are very psychic, very intuitive. Yeah, you are. You read people uh, and their behavior very well. People cannot um, fool you with their empty words. Yeah, you, you read people very well. Continue listening to your intuition, your wisdom, Scorpio. Yeah, you're going to make right decisions. You see very clearly who authentic people are in your life and who fake people are. Yeah. Universe, please show us this soulmate of Scorpio. This soulmate of Scorpio. What's going on currently with the soulmate of Scorpio? And how is the soulmate of Scorpio towards Scorpio at this time? What's going on currently with the soulmate of Scorpio? And how is the soulmate of Scorpio towards Scorpio at this time? Let's see. Yeah, I see. They're missing you a lot. They recognize that they did not put work into this like they should have. And that's why they're not with you, you see. Now they're missing you and they realize they need to change something if they want to be back in your life. Yeah, so again, for second time, Six of Cups, this time from the bigger tarot deck. This person is reminiscing of you day and night, missing you, thinking of you, wanting a reunion with you. Yeah, so to be honest with you, uh, this person tried to completely forget you, release you, not think of you, not miss you, and it didn't work. Yeah, this person is not able to let you go, and it's because of their feelings for you. Their heart is not releasing you. Yeah, yeah, they want to be brave enough to approach you. Look, they're quiet, silent, retreating in solitude, heartbroken over losing you. This is showing up in the subconscious position, which means that this person doesn't want anybody to know, including you, how deeply heartbroken they feel. They holding all those emotions, feelings inside. So if you were to look at them from the outside, you would think everything is okay, but inside they hiding it. Yeah, this person's hiding how deeply heartbroken, emotionally devastated they are over losing you. They love you a lot. Yeah, this person cares for you genuinely, deeply. Universe, please show us. Um, wow, they tired of this silence. And there's few of them that are communicating with you uh, sporadically, but they're not really expressing their true feelings. Universe, please show us what's going on currently with the soulmate of Scorpio. They cutting trees today. Yeah, look at this. They don't want to fight, argue. They don't like that energy between the two of you. Yeah. This person is concerned that there are some people in your life that don't want to see them back in your life. Yeah, so there are some people in your life that are very protective of you who don't want to see this person back in your life. And this person is either feeling it or they're aware of it for a fact. 
They want to apologize. This means apologies, peace offerings, gifts, explanations, tokens of appreciation, emotional in nature, because this is a cup. Ooh, this person deeply regrets losing you. They think you let them go for good. This person is very heartbroken over losing you. They fault themselves for losing you. So they recognize very clearly the mistakes they've made and they regret those mistakes. Yeah. They're trying to learn. Yeah, they're trying to be accountable for their actions. A lot of you are dealing with Taurus, Leo, and Scorpio. Um, the problem, though, is that because they're showing up as emperor and they're facing these energies here, this person has very hard time showing they are emotionally vulnerable. They don't like to show that they are emotionally affected. They don't like to express emotions. Yeah, they don't like to initiate communication. This person has very hard time admitting to their mistakes to others. They have hard time apologizing. Yeah. You know, their, their ego is in the way, you see? Their ego, their emperor persona is in the way of the doing the right thing here. Yeah. It's, it's uh, sabotaging their relationships with other people. This person is showing up as attractive and successful, admired by their peers, by their uh, associates or business partners or coworkers. It's, it's hard for them to admit that they've failed at something. They like to be admired. They like to be recognized for their accomplishments. Um, universe, please show us hmm, what's going on currently with the soulmate of Scorpio and how's the soulmate of Scorpio towards Scorpio at this time? Yeah, you see, look at this. This person wants to be back in your life. Yeah, they don't like to fight, argue. They view you as very different from others. You stood your ground. You stood up for yourself. They respect you, even though they don't like the fact that you left. They respect you for recognizing your worth and walking away for valid reasons. So this person is honest with themselves. They recognize the mistakes and they don't blame you for walking away, either though uh, they don't like it. Yeah, you see, they're holding on to you for dear life, not letting you go, not releasing you. They want so badly to communicate with you, so badly. Yeah, this person is waiting for this uh, communication to happen. They're waiting to be brave enough to approach you. This is a heavy reading. They love you a lot. I can't deny that. Let's see, universe, please show us um, what's going on currently with the soulmate of Scorpio. Yeah, this is how they view you towards them not trusting them. You told them goodbye. You told them what time it is. You were very honest, blunt. Yeah. There's something you said to them that was very severe, uh, but they needed to hear it. It was the truth. That's why it hurt them so deeply because they didn't want to hear that truth, but they needed to hear it. And they agree with you, even though they don't like hearing it. They absolutely agree with you. It hurt their pride, ego to hear that from you, but you needed to be honest. So you did what you needed to do. Yeah. You see, they have so much respect for you, for standing your ground, for standing up for yourself, taking your power back and recognizing your worth. You hold very highly vibrational empress energy, whether you're male or female, which means that you have very high standards. You cannot be in a toxic relationship. No, you can't. Yeah, you have high vibration energy. Ooh, this person is so deeply heartbroken over losing you. You have no idea. And they know they caused you heartbreak. They didn't mean to. They really didn't mean to hurt you. But the point is you got hurt. They know. And you expressed it to them. Yeah, you did. You expressed it to them. You were very honest. This person is trying to be brave enough, courageous enough to approach you. They love you a lot. I can't deny that fact that they love you a lot. Yeah, they do. Um, they can't let you go, even though they, their ego tried to completely release you. It didn't work because of how they feel about you <coughs> emotionally. Scorpio, we're going to go into your extended reading and ask about the soulmate. <coughs> Sorry, guys. Ask about the soulmate's true, genuine 
long-term intentions and plans for you at this time what they planning long term then we're going to ask what they currently hiding from you what they have up their sleeve whether they hiding it on purpose or can communicate for whatever reason but the universe feels you need to be aware of for your highest good and of course at the end we're going to ask advice for you on how to best handle the summit connection at this time and anything else you need to know about your life including new soulmates entering your life new chapters new beginnings in your life also your health finances business job opportunities family matters friendships whatever it is you need to know they'll show it at the end of the reading as well so scorpio click on the extended link below this video in the description box below and i'll see you there love you guys